Hi guys, Jose Bo. The stock market has been crazy for the last few weeks regarding Chinese stocks and Alibaba is no exception as well. In this video, I will be sharing with you some of the news that caused it and my short term price prediction based on the price chart of Alibaba stock. On 7 July 2021, the Chinese regulators mentioned that they will be punishing Chinese companies that are involved in these 22 investment deals that failed to seek merger pre-approval from the government. Anyway, this statement is in Chinese language, so I will put the link in the description below if you decide to take up any Chinese language lesson. Although the fines of US $77 each is a small amount to many tech giants, it's the largest batch since Chinese regulators began to crack down on major tech companies late last year. Out of the 22 fine deals, TT accounts for 8, Alibaba 6, Tencent 5, Suning 2 and Meituan 1. Many of the deals are made through subsidiaries of these companies. I mean, seriously? I have been investing in the stock market for many years. Some of these deals were finalized more than 10 years ago. On one hand, I feel that these Chinese regulators have nothing better to do when they are digging into cases that happened many years back. <coughs> Does Chinese regulators really have this backside itchy syndrome? I mean, backside. They seem really free to dig out matters that happened more than 10 years ago. At the same time, I feel that the Chinese regulators are moving in the direction of stricter enforcement for new and existing companies. However, this stricter enforcement leads to uncertainty in the market and causes share price of Alibaba and 5 other major Chinese companies to drop from February 2021 till right now. This caused the stock price of Queb, which is China Internet Exchange Traded Fund, to drop 41% from February 2021 till right now. And the good news is that Queb Exchange Traded Fund PE ratio has dropped from 40 to 30 right now, which means based on valuation, it is considered cheaper to own the China Internet industry right now compared to the past. The top few holdings of this fund are Tencent Holdings, Alibaba, Meituan, Pingtuo and many more. I'll put the link in the description below for your reference. Regarding the current Alibaba stock price, let's move into the price chart. Okay, so this is Baba price chart and usually I will draw a support and resistance line. 5 year chart, let me scroll, cool, support our match all the low points together and all the high points together which is the resistance lines mm. so i can see from here this is a very strong support line because almost every time when it touches this line the stock price will bounce up can you see 1 point 2 point 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 so right now it's around this point and a disclaimer just to share with you a few days ago alibaba stock price have dropped below 200 dollars therefore few days ago i have just purchased or add on my alibaba holdings because i feel that currently it is at a very strong support line therefore it has high chance that it will bounce up in a short term position moreover based on fundamentals Alibaba is a cash generating machine, therefore I have high conviction in this business. Personally, my investment decision is mainly based on fundamentals instead of price charts. Therefore, comment down below to share with me your opinion of my price charts. I'm really curious to know about your opinion as well. I hope that this video benefits you and allows you to understand the current situation of the Chinese stocks and Alibaba. Do watch this video right now to find out whether Alibaba or JD is a better business. I will see you there.